Hey everyone, everyone welcome, welcome back, back to 5 Minute Eats and today we have got a little Thai tea beverage for you. We've reviewed a lot of those. I believe we have a playlist. If we don't, we've got one now. And I love Thai tea. What do you think about it? I think it's all right. Well, today we're gonna find out how this one is. This is the Pop and Bottle Thai Tea Almond Latte Plant Powered No Refined Sugar. Dun, dun, dun. 60 milligrams of caffeine per bottle here and this is 11 ounces i picked this up at whole foods and it was original price i believe three dollars but because i'm a prime member you get a discount so it was on sale for 240 per bottle now it's got a very interesting packaging mm -hmm. i love the packaging i think it looks nice the bottle feels very thick yes it does it seems like a premium presentation here it does yeah now, I could see this being very popular with the ladies because it yes. seems to be targeting them. Now, interesting thing about Thai tea is, if you guys don't know, uh, it's typically like an orange color. Mm -hmm. And supposedly that orange color comes from the same powder they use for Kraft mac and cheese. Yes, that, that turns, is the legend. You know, that's supposedly the rumor and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Is it true? Don't really know. But this, this is not orange. This looks like your typical um, coffee yeah. and cream, you know? Kind mm -hmm. of color, so it smells very sweet. Now this is gonna be tea. Do you like tea? I well, you know, I don't drink tea on its own a whole lot, but I do love Thai tea. I and like an iced tea. I was gonna say we all sweet love tea. iced teas, right? Yes. So guys, if you're new to our channel, basically we review our day grocery items. So before you spend your harder money, let us tell you if it's worth it. I think that this smells good. Does it smell like Thai tea though? I don't know. If you'd like to support this channel, the easiest way to do that is using our Amazon links the next time you shop there. Hey right, guys, welcome back our rating system. Thumbs up right again, thumbs down, we've been out. So for me, this is a thumbs down. I don't hate it. There was one thing that really turned me off to this. This is an interesting drink. I like the sugar level in this. I think it tastes pretty good. But there's one issue here. Now, looking at the ingredients, um, looks like it's got a lot going on. Almond milk, dates, black tea, Himalayan, pink salt, vanilla extract, tamarind paste, orange extracts, spice extracts, um, star anise, cardamom, cinnamon, monk fruit. Um, you know, it's got a lot of stuff going on, right? It's grainy which I didn't really like. Mm. So for me, I would not buy this again because of that. I don't wanna, I wanna drink something. I don't wanna like have all kinds of particles floating in my mouth, right? Mm. Thumbs down. If you like what we're doing here, please consider sending us super thanks. It helps us continue to provide more amazing content. Alrighty, for me, this one is going to be a thumbs down. I think that the flavor is pretty decent. I don't think that it really tastes like a Thai tea, but I can't get over the graininess. Like it's very gritty and I don't love the mouthfeel of it. Now, this is a vegan product, so I know a lot of vegan people are just used to that. They drink a lot of gritty type of drinks from what we've tried and they don't mind it. But I just feel like because we have options, because we're not vegan, I, I would choose not to have it. If they could make this not grainy, I would have it. I, I wouldn't agree. call it a Thai tea though. But I think that the dates, while I like dates, to me this tasted more like a date drink than anything else because they were very forward in the flavor. Like it was very strongly date flavored. But I do think that the spices and stuff, they tasted good. But the texture of the drink, that's enough to make me not want to have it again. To sum it up, thumbs down, thumbs down. And if you guys buy from Amazon, use our Amazon link. The reason is when you do that, we get 10 cents, 50 cents, possibly even a dollar, which means we can continue to review things. All right, guys, that's the video. If you like what we're doing here, definitely check out our other channel, Food Prep Inc. And don't forget to give us a like and subscribe.